Okay. Yep, she's going. Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a baby haul of gifts for the baby that we have received over the Christmas holiday. We are now home, nestling into our house, waiting for the baby's arrival, trying to take it easy. My back's been hurting a lot. I have had to do more massages than usual. I'm seeing my doctor now twice a week, and soon enough it'll be once a week. Literally, soon enough. <laughs> it's The time's just coming, it's gonna fly by, and it's it's just gonna, the time's gonna get there, but she will come out when she's ready and fully cooked. That's my prayers for this baby girl. I have received gifts from family and friends, lots and lots from my sister-in-law, mostly lots of hand-me-downs, which I am so grateful, so that way I don't have to be spending money that she's already done for all of us, <laughs> for all the younger ones, since she is firstborn in her family. And luckily she's had two girls. I'm getting a lot of clothes. Some of them you'll see behind. Other is a gift from Jordan's cousin and godmother slash aunt. And I will be showing you that. I will actually be opening that gift on camera since I have yet to see it. We brought it back home and uh, neither of us have seen it besides what's already been exposed through the silicone paper, right? <laughs> so behind me I have my fireplace going. Just trying to take it easy still loving the holidays you know me christmas is it's not over yet i'm taking down my christmas decor on january 7th which is king's day I expect to see more videos at least for the next week until the christmas decor have been taken down the first thing i'll show you is a gift from a friend just because i have it right here and unfortunately she won't be able to come to the baby shower hence why she gave it to me ahead of time the first thing is the book, Garbage Delight. I have asked for books instead of cards for my family and friends. I've asked for books for the baby since I have nothing. I have no toys. I have nothing baby kid related. And I've been collecting a lot of things from neighbors, from my sister-in-law, and now hopefully getting more books as we receive gifts because we would really appreciate it. And then I'll show you these cute little things. Everything's getting washed today. This is actually the perfect day to wash clothes. So, I'll just show you. Go cute! A little onesie. And love my family. Onesie. Long sleeve. And keep calm. And call grandma. This is peekaboo playa. <laughs> so cute. These are just so cute. Long sleeve. Onesie. Here's another gray one. So sorry about the interruption, but we had company over and three hours later, we're back at this. This is a cute one too genius of the family this is perfect especially because what my husband does and lastly i received from my friend is kicking it in the crib which is hilarious i did get a couple things from my mom this is for my mom it's a little lamb and it plays music lullaby lamb for kelly comfort but what i also like is you can hang this on the car seat or on the crib um, just for the baby's gonna lounge. What is it? What does that call like that play mat? My brother's girlfriend got us this The Wabanob. I've heard so many good things about this Wabanob and it's an elephant Favorite animal right now. It's the baby's animal. I got a couple things from my colleagues at work So this little toy high chair pal what I like about it, it's got different things. So it's got the suction cup It's got obviously a little footy toys here It's got a mirror and a twisty. That's kind of cool. The onesies with pandas on them. So cute. So cute. <coughs> this baby is so spoiled. Love it already. And the little Bambi <laughs> with the little flower in the bum. So cute. Some of this is uh, mixed between my mother in law and sister in law. And some more friends. So we got this little outfit, cats, and apparently these glow in the dark. The baby newborn set. What I love is they've given me a variety of sizes, not just one size. So as the baby grows, well, I've been told the baby grows every second. So yes, kids grow all the time. So I'm glad they gave me separate sizes or different sizes just so the baby can have things to wear. I love this one. It's a leopard dress. Isn't this the cutest little thing? It's a Kate Spade leopard dress. And it says 2T, but... I mean, we'll just see how tall this baby is because my husband's tall. Look at that! It's so cute! 
Now I just need a dress like this. So we can match. So I got the, I got gifted the, I'm gonna say it's Boule Bijouterie Pour Mama. I mean, I wrote it in French here. It's a teething jewelry. Essentially, I put this on like a necklace. Oh, I'll show you the picture that's here. Can you see that? You put it on as a necklace, and as the baby is teething, the baby could chew on this. Baby's first year belly stickers. That's kind of cool. So that when we're taking pictures of the baby each month, we can stick this on. I think my mother-in-law gave me this. Look at that. With shorts. I know. It's just everything is so cute onesies these onesies they just feel so soft i absolutely love it baby's already so spoiled and she's not even here yet i love it thank you so much nike outfits little tennis outfit so cute juicy couture outfit look how adorable that is with the matching fleece pants Jessica simpson outfit and again i'm just loving that we received different sizes for the baby girl I'm gonna get into the gift that Jordan's cousin and aunt slash godmother gave us as a gift and it's in a pink box in the back. They unfortunately aren't gonna be able to make the baby shower so they gave us the gift at Christmas when we were there. So I'd like to open it on camera since we haven't seen anything that's in it. And I want my husband to just be in the lookout because he hasn't seen it either. Okay, so this is what I was able to see through the wrap. I love these. I got a couple ones in the registry that I have requested. So these are good. They're baby child size hangers. Oh, and I got some more. She's so cute. Okay, so this gift a card. I'm gonna let my. I'm gonna let Javi read that. So I'll give that to you off while camera. I open while I open it up. Yeah, off camera. Oh, she got me a book. She knows I've been wanting books for the baby. So the first one says, Merry Christmas, Bright Baby Touch and Feel. So that's kind of cool. Look, babe, she'll be able to touch and feel. Mm -hmm. It's very nice. Thanks, Lori. Oh, first numbers. So cute. I'm just showing hubby. That's why I'm aiming it over there. Oh, amazing. Robert Munch. Oh, I love Robert Munch. That man. He's done so good things. Robert Munch hugs. Red is best. 25 years, story by Kathy Stinson. You guys know this book too? Another one, Baby's First ABCs. Show it to the camera. Look how cute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at all this, Jordan. Okay, so the first thing is tights to her dresses. Oh, so cute. Look, she's gonna be so Canadian. Look at that, that little dress. I love it. Oh, thanks for the different sizes too, Lori and Aunt Jerry. Look at that, that's a cute one. Yes, so it's a fleece sweater and I see a onesie underneath peeking through. Right there, the onesie. And pants, gift receipts, because they're so adorable. We're not returning anything, Lori. Okay, basket. There's a small basket within the basket. Hair and body wash, cute from Arbonne. Oh, nice. Look, babe. Just Thank you. Hold on, I'm gonna cut this. <laughs> Arbonne baby care body lotion for the baby. I just like that it's the health, the healthy one. And Arbonne's like that. Arbonne's baby care morning bubble bath. The Johnson's baby lotion, very popular brand. And the baby oil. Pocket keep hands at right temperature. Hot and cold pack. It's for the baby. Oral care. Yes, thank you. Oh, so cute. This brings me back to my childhood. We put this on everything. Penitin. The oil. And it's the Arbonne brand. We use these for things in the nursery, so that's good. There's more. Keep poking over here because my husband is seeing this for the first time as I am. 500 wipes. <laughs> because she's a mom and Aunt Jerry obviously she's a mom so they know what's needed for the bebe. Love the wrapping paper too. Dust! Dust wipes! Because we can't get enough as I've been told. Awesome. That's it. <laughs> Thanks so much Lori and Aunt Jerry. It's so cute. Jordan was here the whole time so he watched everything of us opening your gift. We really appreciate it. I'm going to show you just a couple things that my sister-in-law has given me 
has gifted and let me borrow for the bebe since she has two girls. With two girls, you obviously get an abundance of toys, clothes, accessories, baby things really that you need. And her eldest is eight years old. So some of this stuff has been in her possession since her little girl was born, now that she's eight. And of course, a few things are new. She did say that there's a few things with tags. Can you believe that? You buy so much clothes and there's still tags in them. She told me that's what, they, that's what happens. And that for hand-me-downs that are being now given to our baby, I'm telling you, we are more than appreciated because clothes are expensive and baby clothes are expensive, especially like, brand name clothes for $30 that they only wear once, maybe twice, because then they're outgrowing it within six months. That's crazy because kids are always growing. And I'll show you a couple things that stand out and that are at my fingertips, but I'm gonna tell you, it is nowhere near what she has gifted us already and what she is going to let us borrow before the baby gets here. I have to show this because this is from Jordan's grandmother who crocheted it. Isn't this the cute little little thing? That means it's gonna be our baby girl's great grandmother who has crocheted this. It is so precious. My sister-in-law might have worn this. This is a definite outfit that I'm hoping the baby fits in. So it's a jacket with the matching dress. Sunday outfit. And look how cute this little sweater dress is. Jordan's grandmother made that. And this is also a smocking, that's what the term is, dress. Look how cute this is, she made this too. So, that way she has a little bit of her great grandmother as she's here in the world. Bathrobe. Uh, this is more like for the pool. Right, so this is fairly new because you got, you have Elsa and Anna here. Some little bunny that you see my husband's. Now it's gonna go to our little baby girl. <laughs> But what I love is like the baby tends to learn, right? She tie her shoes, Velcro, zip, right? I love it. This is for when you're shopping in the shopping cart. That's where this goes. These are all, if you haven't guessed it yet, these are all cloth diapers. <laughs> Got a whole bunch in here to last me. And there's a bunch of colors in here as well. That is something we will attempt to do. Hopefully it works for us because it will save us a lot of money in the long run. The Baby Bjorn, Baby Bjorn carrier. Oh, and Jordan's male cousin, who also had a baby with his wife. I keep in contact with her and she gave us a couple things as well. Some things to borrow. So she also gave us another carrier. This is the only thing that Jordan asked for was a carrier. That's all he wanted for this baby so that he can take the baby out and about as we're walking or whatnot. And now he's got three that he can use, which is amazing for him. So thank you very much. Another helpful thing will be this bumble seat with the tray. I'll be good when the baby's able to sit up. The stuff that wasn't even open because you received doubles. I firmly believe it when Jordan's cousins give us this and it's still in the packaging and it hasn't been opened. So thank you very much. Oh, baby blankets. Some more blankets. So cute. And mommies know this, the Moby Wrap. This stuff is, is going to be very helpful. A few other things that I can show you now is a baby crib mattress cover. And in this is the bottles for the Medela pump. My sister-in-law is going to let me borrow which is going to save me a lot of money as well. It's been in storage, but my sister-in-law is very meticulous about cleaning her own stuff, so I know everything's been sanitized and clean, cleaned as she's been using it. Matter of, it's been in storage, so just need to clean off and dust off the, the dust. This dry dry shoes. This girl doesn't need to go to the shopping mall because her shopping mall will be her bedroom. Her bedroom is going to have ample amounts of clothes. You have these mitts. Look how cute that is. So adorable. Here, you notice that there's like toys my sister-in-law gave me lots of books and toys raccoons puzzles see that dinosaurs my little niece loves dinosaurs ladybug just trying to show you the popular items i call them or the stuff that you need to go buy anyways and my sister-in-law's like let us have them for the baby but she is so Awesome that she's giving us way lots of stuff. This, she told me, goes into the car seat so that when the baby has a poop, 
blast. <laughs> it doesn't go on your car seat. Isn't that amazing? That's amazing. Look how cute that is. Look at this leopard. It's so cute. Its little tail. Oh, I remember this. So we actually gave Jordan's eldest niece this outfit. I remember this real well. I think we gave it to her for her birthday or her first Christmas that I met her. And it's the Puma outfit. Do you remember this, babe? Yeah. Here's a little Puma. That's my husband, because I had to show him. He wanted to come over and, and check. And I know it comes with pants, but because, you know, we have everything rumbled around here, I will find the pants, because I know it comes with pants. <laughs> That's this type of stuff. Like, you, you buy things for your nieces and nephews, and, you know, once you have kids, then you might end up with the same hand-me-downs, and it's stuff that you purchase for them. Look at this, a Halloween costume. Like, peas in a pod. She already has a Halloween costume. Isn't that crazy? This baby girl isn't even here and she's got more clothes than I have. Look at this. I bought this for her too. Little bikini. So cute. Look at that. Yes, everything is very cute in this haul. Oh, here's the pants for the Puma outfit that I showed earlier. See? And we bought her matching shoes. Here's what I was mentioning about a tag. This was never worn because the tag is still on, which means it was never washed. And it just says baby boots. But see, stuff like that, because you buy an abundance of clothes for your child, they seem to grow out of half the stuff that you may buy them. If you can save money, like I am right now, getting clothes from my sister-in-law and other people, then appreciate what you can get because that's a lot of money here spent on these two little nieces of mine. And now my little girl is going to be able to enjoy this. Look at this, it's one of the Uggs. So cute. My baby girl has Uggs and I don't even have Uggs. Can you believe that? See? And they're still in well good condition. Get to see the little crab outfit. These are great. These go in baby's closet and you can separate your clothing accordingly to the labels. You see that? These are so helpful, very organized. I had these in my registry and I just took them off probably two days ago when I received these and I knew that my sister-in-law had them and was going to gift them to me. Everything's getting washed, so she did say wash everything, obviously. It's been in plastic bins, so you'll need to wash them. Look how cute this is. It's crocheted as well, I believe. How cute this is. This is turning into a baby haul slash reveal of baby's future clothes. Because I'm telling you, the baby will be wearing these clothes. Look, one of the sleepers. So I've had to delete some of the sleepers off my registry again because she's gifting a lot of these sleepers. Here's the other Uggs, we found it. We got some ski boots, because the baby will be skiing. Absolutely, the baby will be doing some winter sports. Her father loves to ski and be out in the outdoors. Uh, so we need to show the baby how to ski. Color that her, her nursery will be, a little bit of lilacs with hints of blush pink and great the other boot ski boot a dress adorable yeah for somebody's wedding or a special occasion i think i showed you at least the popular items and the ones that i was able to pull out of the bags that you saw in this video see i'm in the mountain of clothes right here i can put my hand on them and i'm exhausted i'm going to start the laundry i'm going to separate things accordingly and then start the laundry. And I'll be able to hang some of them courtesy of Lori, of cousin Lori, and you know, it's gonna be a great year because the bid does not need to go do any shopping. This will be the first time that I, as someone that loves to shop, will not need to go into any of the malls to buy clothes because she has a bunch right here. I want to thank, lots of people we want to thank for obviously all of this is people that bought us gifts. Thank you, thank you everybody. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe so that you can see the baby with these clothes on in future videos. I'll strive to have her wear all these clothes. I hope you all have a good day. Happy New Year. I think I'm going to be posting this video in the New Year. I hope you all had a great Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year to you all. Take care.